many of you I have not had a chance to meet yet. Uh, I'm Georgia Nugent. I am serving as the president, the interim president, uh, at Illinois Wesleyan this year. I want to echo Steve. What a wonderful event this is um, to see so many benefactors gathered together here tonight with their students to me provides very tangible evidence of how much our alumni and friends understand and value the education that Illinois Wesleyan can offer. As well, this large gathering, and largest ever, I guess, um, enables us to literally see the IWU family in action as one generation passes on to another the transformative power of higher education. The poet William Wordsworth has a beautiful line which has been very meaningful to me as an educator. Others will love what we have loved and we will teach them how. That's really what we see before us in this room tonight. The benefactors who have graduated from Illinois Wesleyan or have become friends of the university are really professing their love of the liberal arts and their appreciation of its value and passing it on to others. Today, there's a widespread misunderstanding of what liberal arts education even is. The very term often causes confusion. No, liberal in this context has nothing to do with politics. It refers instead to, and I am a classicist, bear with me, I'm a Latin and Greek professor. <laughs> It refers instead to freedom, to the liberty that education can provide a person. And arts, pace, lark, and star, <laughs> arts is not about drawing or dance. It's actually the Latin word for skills, techniques, abilities. For the last six years and more, I've been working at the national level with a kind of evangelical zeal to dispel the many myths that do surround liberal arts and to spread the good news about their power and value. Because the evidence could not be clearer. There may be short-term advantage in a more circumscribed or technical education. Yes, it's true that engineers, for example, start out with a higher salary than philosophy majors right after graduation. But you know what? By mid-career, those philosophical thinkers catch up and even surpass the bridge builders and the coders. They become the managers, the CEOs, the leaders, the innovators, because of the breadth of the education they've received. It gives them the tool set to bring many different kinds of understanding to whatever they undertake. Year after year, there are new research studies showing the lifelong advantages of a liberal arts education. And that's what those of us here tonight understand and are really contributing for the future. So yes, I'm a true believer in the liberal arts, but I don't believe that's at odds with developing pragmatic skills or with pre professional studies. And at IWU, we have the best of both worlds. Again, it's been shown time and time again that the most successful education is one that combines the study of liberal arts with practical training as well. Here, you can deepen your understanding of the Spanish language as well as prepare for a career in nursing or business. Here, you can develop your skills as a pianist while also following your passion to be an entrepreneur. The marriage of possibilities in this way is, to my mind, our brand, the promise we offer our students. And the evidence is clear that that promise is fulfilled. You see some of it on our boasting banners around the campus. Among, among graduates of Illinois schools, IWU alums earn the highest salaries. Even more amazing, we are among the top schools in the country in providing social mobility, that is moving our students from the lowest economic class to the highest. That's something to really be proud of. 
Now, it's easy to point to these kinds of financial benefits, but it's much more difficult to describe a different kind of payoff from an Illinois Wesleyan education. The enrichment, not in dollars, but in the satisfaction and personal well-being that stems from developing lifelong interests, lifelong friendships, a capacity and taste for lifelong learning. That's the more elusive, but the greater gift that you as benefactors make available to the students here tonight. I know they're grateful, I am grateful, the entire IWU family thanks you. <laughs>